안녕하세요. I'm your friend, Rice Power. These days, whenever I visit shopping center, drinking street, and popular areas in Korea, always I can see soppa restaurant. It's not just a trend anymore, and with special recipe from my military service. Okay, give you music. Soppa means using this kind of pot to make rice. It can be divided into two kinds, using stone pot to use a high pressure, or using colorful and non-pressure pot. About the taste, definitely using stone is much better, but it's much easier to wash. It is so much important in cooking. To make rice using pot is very classic in history. So today's topic is if there was butter in the Joseon dynasty. Symbol of Korea. Kimchi, onion, and butter combination doesn't make unbelievable taste, but when it mixed with rice, it tastes amazing. Pot is different from rice cooker, so human needs to adjust timing. High heat, boiling start, medium heat, low heat, and resting two minutes. This is why rice cooker was created. But pot rice has hidden advantage. Looking very similar to kimchi fried rice. But for soppa, kimchi is fried, boiled, and steamed. It's... <sighs> oh. mm -hmm. If I had some famous options, Here, Korean beef 2 plus number 9. It'll be. Oh. Here it is kimchi butter beef soppa. Casual yet luxurious, classic yet modern feel. I mean, it's super delicious. Whoa. If there were butter and cheese in the Joseon dynasty, definitely I could have seen this recipe in textbook. Because the butter kimchi flavor is smooth, with sweet onion, beef is bomb, and it's easy to wash. Everything is perfect. And this is hidden advantage. Pot rice naturally makes scorched rice. I said before, it's one of the popular menus in the military. Today is a slightly more upgraded version. Kimchi Nurungji Ramen. Mm. Do you know where the most creative ramen recipes come from? Military. Naturally, I could learn many recipes. How about the ramen recipes? Rather than chef, soldier. These days, soppa is like putting big Korean food culture into small pot. So with the pride of Korea. Half is for now, and another is for when watching Asian Cup. Perfect plan. The sauce has to be strong. For soccer, the additive strong, slightly sweet, and salty sauce will lead to victory. And I want to add a little bit umami flavor to the rice. These two kinds are enough. This kind of small detail changed many things, like the sake. Kimchi, barley chive, and water celery. These are Irma's best friends with pork in Korea. Especially his celery goes well with seafood too. When frying kimchi with sesame oil, the flavor changes dramatically. About the chive, I saw I, I saw Korean chive sauce products in Canada supermarket. Little bit surprised, you can use that kind of thing. Maybe same taste. Oh, bling bling. 
It's already perfect. For a short time on a pan, butter, garlic, and chili powder. The taste will slap. I wanted to try using this expression. Is it correct? Here is Korean pork belly soppa. Wow. This is the most mm, in reason, this is the most table taste food mm. I have made. As soon as I put it in my mouth, just full flavor explodes. When salty and sweet flavors intersect very well, human feel the taste is crazy. Crazy. Mm. The taste slaps. <laughs> I will write down something is option, this one is option. Even if you skip those options, the taste is similar. So it's easy to try it. Slaps. Nurunji ramen probably my military service memories. Using any brand of jajang ramen is fine. Ganjampong is the main ingredient. After finishing hot training this one, that is amazing. If I make it this far, I'm it. Put string cheese and sausage here. Here is Kanpageti. Kanjambu tastes like a cross between seafood and meat. So much strong taste and little bit spicy. But by the jajang sauce and cheese, the taste is neutralized. 89%? You can buy both of them overseas. It's a little funny to introduce the Korean military food, but there are so many good recipes. It feels like undiscovered new continent. Everybody bundle up before you go outside. Weather is crazy. See you in next video. Have a great day. Your subscription and likes give me power.